it's lunch day Ooh, this is the day the Lord has made and we will rejoice and be glad in it it took 10 months 10 months but we're lunching this morning I gotta go let's go Okay, so as we've been building this with you guys, I told you some of the things that were gonna happen, but not everything. So we have this shelving here. All of this is made in Ghana. Let me take my labels. It's taking a lot to get these things done, but finally we're getting somewhere. We're like maybe like 90% done. There are more things I'd like to, but we have to make some sales first before we start acquiring new things. So this place was designed by Creative Stephanie Lima. She's an interior architect. She gave me a lot of the concepts for this place. So I definitely have to acknowledge her. Hey, hey and Ken, um, that's his one of his her colleagues. They did a really good job. If you look over here, we have a cafe corner. I'll take you guys there back in the middle. In a minute, sorry. We have a, a pastry case over here for everything that you would need in a cafe. We also are serving local coffee. Really, 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 really good coffee. So over here, I have like animal crackers because I used to love them. I'm thinking the kids will love them. We had some kids in here yesterday. And these are coated peanuts from a local bakery. And this is our packaging for our pastries. We'll put them in this package or in another package as well. And these are our sizes, our sizes for our coffee drinks. So, um, you see here we have some donuts, some cupcakes, extra donuts, and some cupcakes as well. There'll be other stuff that'll be coming here. I have a cookie jar here right now for cookies. I'm waiting for those. And these are some big local donuts as well. Now the coffee that we're using is Kawamoka coffee. I wanted to use another kind of coffee, but this is also very, very good. So the coffee that we use in our cafe is Kawamoka. It's harvested in the Volta region near Afajato, which is like the highest mountain in Ghana. Um, so it's really good coffee. It's really really good coffee. We've been trying it and this is our little setup here that we have going a Menu board that's our menu board over there Prices are very affordable and very fair. We want everybody to come in here try something now We're selling extra Kawamoka coffee as well, and I had these little things as well I saw oh, let me just put them here to make the place look like um, a coffee shop make them comfortable So if you came here, you would sit over here I'm gonna bring in some books as well so people can come in here and read whilst they order some coffee Sit here plug in your laptop. We have free Wi-Fi everything that you need will be here Okay, now, so this is our fridge. I had to customize the fridge because it usually has these um, brand, you know, stuff over there. I don't understand why we're giving them free ads when we needed the ads. So it just tells you right when you enter the shop all the things that we have inside the fridge. And we have a life plant over here and our baskets are right here. So it's a really clean, very easy, simple operation that we have going here. Our cash counter is right here. You could have like little candies and stuff. Over here we have some stationery as well, of course. Hand sanitizer. And this is local Ghana chocolate. No imported chocolate, okay? Local Ghana chocolate. Now over here we have what I call the try me section, which is pretty much the sample section. So this guy named Chris makes these, this shea butter. And he brought it out. This is really good. In December, I'm going to make a box. Like a Ghana made box. I'll put that in there. And these are very um, popular groceries that Ghanaians like, use. I also have the local ones in there. If you look at this one, it's Tiger Nut Powder. But uh, a producer, her name is Hadia. She makes this herself. It's FDA approved. And we have... 
Okay, now this is not my rice. All my friends come in here and they're like, Is it your rice? Did you start making rice? No, I didn't make rice. It's called Nana Rice. It's by a company called Agro Kings and they grow it locally here in Ghana. And we eat a lot of rice. I eat a lot of rice. So I said, Let's get Nana Rice in here. And it's actually ironic that people think that I own it. It even makes it better for me. So we just sold one the other day, a big one. I'm super excited for people to try it because local rice is preferred in Ghana I don't know why for people that make you know everything grow we don't seem to want ours but yeah I definitely decided to bring that in here I have another Ghana made product here called nuts it's from tamale and it's um, African liquid black soap Farouk is the distributor he's also a friend of mine it's really good it doesn't smell like black soap at all like that sharp like smell that black soap has this one does not have it this is bleach by a girl called Barbara she does this um, bleach and cleaning products for a company called clean all so I got that as well and she's the only bleach I'm gonna have on the counter I'm not gonna have anything else just to give her a fighting chance I think it's really good we already sold some of them so really really good stuff if you come by just try and buy the Ghana made ones as well so you can try them out they're super cool now over here I got a lot of requests for this chicken sausage now I'm not a fan of sausage but the market you know determines what we stock so they asked for this chicken sausage and I have that in here here. and I also decided to freeze some tomatoes I got these fresh organic tomatoes that I got from Adorso now the thing with it is that a lot of people join Sundays to just really want to get something quick you know to blend I know how cooking Ghanaian food is so I have that frozen tomatoes in here if you come you just pick it up you go to your house blend it I've already washed peeled everything is ready for you now this is um, fresh chicken as well it's fresh organic chicken it's a full chicken so all the parts are in there better for you we will not be serving frozen chicken over here and this is like lamb and we have beef as well over here now when you look here um, a lady called Adam of Eagle Spices she has no ginger powder shrimp powder um, powdered pepper mixed spices she has a whole range of things so I would definitely you know be stocking her stuff so when you come in here you can get these as well Okay, so now we're outside at the plant store. Now this place was very important for me to have because a lot of the new buildings in Ghana do not have gardens and they do not have places for you to plant pots, um, pl potted plants. And it's super important that we do that, you know, cause like how are you gonna breathe easy if we don't have plants? So I got my gardener to give me a selection. I potted them nicely, put some pebbles and stuff in it. And then, you know, they all serve different purposes. So I'll be writing more information right now we just had to rush to open as you can see a banner up there we had to rush to open and I have some imported chips people kind of seem to love this um I find Doritos over here and some Lay's have some eggs and of course Nana rice is right there now this stuff I just got them from the farm I will show you guys the farm is really good um they imported and um, well did not import sorry <laughs> We do not import these. We got them locally from farms that are right next to us. So if you come in here, you get yourself some plantains, some apples. Aubergine is growing Ghana, if you can believe it. There's some avocado and things here as well. So all in all, give me some good luck in the comment section, guys, and give me, you know, some lucky dollars in the spirit and in flesh when you come to Ghana. Just Pass by here, we're on Pantine Road, Ophiriwa Heights. If you want to text us to order something, no matter where in the world you are, you want to try some Ghana made products or you know, have specific requests because you're Ghanaian and you miss Ghana, you saw some chocomilo or something and you want to just send us a text at plus two three three five 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 four four nine three. Really easy. I'm going to put it on the screen and I'll see you guys soon. Are we nervous? I don't know if we're super nervous, but um, as time goes on, we hope to replicate this model all over Ghana. Everywhere we'll get a beautiful corner store like this one. So I will see you guys in my next video. I'll be busy, but I'll update you.
So thank you for watching and staying with us since January when I announced this idea and now it's actually, you know, here in reality. Thank you so much. I'll see you soon. Bye.